Hi, this is Rachel with Rachel's Reading Book Nook, and today I am going to show you inside one of my favorite books. This is called the Classical Music Reference Book, and um, I have been a piano teacher in the past, and I just think this is a wonderful book made um, just to reference the different types of music that have been around in the history, um, and so I want to uh, kind of show you guys what's inside. First, let's look at the table of contents. So, see all the different things that go in here, there are um, 30 pages that are in this book. And so, um, there's lots of different topics that they discuss about what is classical music, writing music down, music and religion, music for entertainment, operas, music for ballet, the orchestra, concerts. So, you see all these different things are featured in here. So, let's kind of look inside some of the pages. What is classical music? As with a lot of Usborne books, I love how the books um, have chunks of information and so kids are um, easily engaged in what they're learning. And so there's lots of pictures too that go along with each uh, information that they're trying to learn. And you see this down here? These are internet links. So if they have um, a QR app on their phone, then you can uh, scan this and it will take them to some music that they can actually listen to. So um, I love that. These are on every page, these internet links. And so it just kind of takes um, the uh, what, what, what they're learning even further on the internet. So here's about writing music down, talking about the first printed music. Um, how notation changed music, high and low notes, um, and so these are just different things that you can apply to um, just general music anywhere, no matter what instrument that you're learning. Um, here's about music and religion. Over here is about music for entertainment. So, you know, these are just, it, this book is just filled with great, great, great info. Um, and then I, I, I really like what's at the end. Um, once you get to the very end of the book, um, you have this timeline. Look at this, and it goes through over here on the side of all the different composers and when they composed. Um, so you starts out with some of the um, earlier composers, keeps on going through some of the ones that um, are a little more recent, and uh, and then it but it ends with 1976. So uh, really, really neat. So I just love this. I think this is a great book, um, and you should, if you uh, have children who are um, really enjoy music and learning about that, then add this to your library. Thanks so much.